Smash the trade passes competition. Uh, he's giving away two prizes. He's giving away a $25 gift card to Amazon, which is a really awesome prize. Thank you for doing this competition. You know, I love watching your videos. Trey Pass is such a really nice guy. He's been on YouTube for such a long time now, and hopefully, he'll be sticking around even longer after you know these competitions and after you know all these kind of changes that happening with YouTube recently, unfortunately, making things a bit more difficult. You know, he's one of those guys that just loves doing what he does, and I love watching his videos. So I'm more than happy to turn to competition mate when I can and you know, support your channel if I win something, pretty awesome. So you've asked three questions uh, based upon a like, kind of like Christmas tale in a sense of a Scrooge type thing, in a sense of what do you regret in the past, in the now and in the future, which the future is a bit more harder because you don't know what you're going to regret in a sense, but I'll do my best and I'm just Okay, what I regret in the past is, I think I would think about this by the way, is maybe not believing in myself properly enough or not sticking up for myself in what I believe in, in a sense. You know, because I didn't have the best of childhoods in a way, I got bullied, you know, at school and I learned difficulties and I still sort of do in ways, but I don't really act upon it. I don't really say, oh, look at me, you know, Andrea, but, you know, I didn't, wasn't the best reader, I wasn't the best writer and, you know, that was a challenge for me. I have to really kind of do that and it's, I've had to, it's a work in progress, you know, it always is. I think I've got better since then, much, much better. And um, yeah, that's something I think it was, and it was just limited to friends and just trying not to stick up for what I like and what I believe in. And you know, people, everyone has their opinions, everyone has their own ways, and I just had other problems going on around me, not just in my school life, but also in personal life. So um, I think it's just the fact of. Yeah, you know, not sticking up for myself. And I, I made up for that now, definitely. I'm 20 years old now and I'm definitely sticking up for myself. I'm definitely sharing my opinions, doing a creative course, you know, and doing a job and expressing my opinions on YouTube, of course, doing film reviews, something like that. So I think it's a case of that, really. That's something I always regret, is just not doing it. But in the sense of that, I've made up for it now, in a way. So, you know, that's one thing I do regret. You know, certain people back in school, just not sticking up for myself, not you know taking action, it, not like violence or anything, but just in cancel, just sticking my ground. That's why I regret in the past definitely. And uh, in like today's kind of regretting, like you know in today's kind of world where I am right now, I think it's just the only way best answer I can come up with really is the fact of I regret missed opportunities, and that's career, that's you know social life, that's could be anything really, I mean there's, I think with any kind of, especially when you're quite young, I think especially you have like lots of different options to you, you know, with college, school, university, you know, what type of thing, friendships, you know, what friends you want to go to, offers, you know, within, you know, careers and just, you know, just lots of different things and I think it's the idea of, you know, you look back at something you're thinking, did I make the right decision? Did, did I turn down that offer for the right reasons, or did I, did I do it for the missed, for the wrong reasons, or did someone say it was, it was bad or good or whatever? I think I regret not taking some of those offers or not acting on some of those decisions. And you know, I, I think there's definitely, and I think at the same time, I also regret making some decisions. You know, within the past couple of years, in the sense, you know, especially with certain people and certain things that have happened in my life. But, um, you know, it's all, you will learn from it, you will take it and move forward with it and, you know, that's what you do in a sense, you know, there's no point regretting forever about it, you know, you made a decision, you live for it and, you know, you learn from your mistakes and that's what it is, unfortunately, that's what, that's what life is about and, you know, I think that's one thing definitely in the now, there's just missed opportunities but you're always going to get that, you're always going to get one choice or the other or you can't take every single option that comes right in front of you, I don't think. And the regretting in the future, I think it's a case of not setting out to do what I want to, especially with the film course I'm doing at the moment at university. It's a case of, you know, it's a very competitive market, it's a very, you know, 
imaginative mm -hmm. course in the sense that, you know, and I'm on my second year, or one more year to go yet, and it's a case of, you know, what's life going to be after education, and am I going to stick with the job I've got, or am I going to try and go for something, you know, it's risks and the day, and I think it's the case of, I want to be proud of something, what I do, and say, yeah, I do that, you know, I'm happy with it. It's not about the money, it's about, you know, saying, you know, I've done that with my life, you know, it's as simple as that, and um, that's something I regret I instantly, right, even right now, is the sense of, am I doing enough to get towards that, you know, is how much work do I put in, you know, how much is it about the people I know to get me into those places, you know, is it taking enough risks, in a sense, have more people got more opportunities than me, in a sense, it's the case of that, and I think that's one aspect of the future, not, you know, regretting not doing enough, maybe, and same with social life, you know, with relationships and stuff like that, is making the right decisions, you know, <coughs> missing out opportunities to get to gang on the kind of thing. So a lot of things like that really, that's my, my regrets in a way. So I uh, hope you enjoyed watching this video, Trey Passer, and anyone who's watching it. Uh, so if you went into this uh, Trey Passer's competition, you've got until tomorrow, he's doing the competition draw at midnight after uh, the first of next year, so that's pretty cool by like the way he's done that. So please uh, go into his competition. So in the meantime, Andrew from Media Farm Game TV, signing out.